to create a neon lines looping video like that. We can use Adobe After Effects. Before creating a project, make sure you have installed the particular plugin from Red Giant. The first step, create a new composition. I'm going to create a main composition in HDTV resolution with a duration of 3 minutes. In this composition, I will create the background first. On the solid layer, I'll add a gradient ramp effect. Here I will set the start and end of the ramp. And then, I'm going to select the color part. If you've created a layer for the background, create another new composition, and I named it Line. To make a line, I use the Pen tool. Deactivate Fill Options. And in the Stroke option, select Solid Color. For the thickness, I set it to 20px with white color. Create a straight line with the Pen tool. If you want to change the edges to a round cap, you can set it in the line cap settings so that it's not too wide. Cut the area where there is only the line. Activate region of interest. Then select the line area. In composition in the menu section, select crop comp to region of interest. If it's done, go back to the main composition. Add the line comp into the main composition create a new solid layer again. I'll name it Particular. Hide line compositions. After that, add a particular effect to the layer. The initial view will look something like that. We need to set it up first. Expand emitters. In particle per second, I change the value to 9. Change the emitter type to box. In direction, select directional. Change the directional spread value to 0%. X-Rotation, 90 degrees. Y-Rotation, 45 degrees. Velocity, 365. In emitter size, select XYZ linked. I changed the emitter size X to 2000. To make the line appear from below, change the position point to the bottom left. Expand particle settings. I change life per second to 10. In particle type, change it to Sprite Colorize. Expand Texture Settings. In the Layer Options, select the Name Composition where we create a line. Make sure the Collapse Transformation icon and the Line Composition is not active. In Size, I changed the value to 200. 
and now the lines appear on the preview screen. For size random, I change it to 50%. In the set color setting of the opacity over life section, select random from gradient. To adjust the color, expand color over life. From these settings, we can choose colors via presets. Or we can choose the color according to what we want. And now, I'm going to choose the color first. In this tutorial, I only use the colors. On Opacity Over Life, I use the preset from the third option. The next step, expand rotation. Then enable Orient to Motion. In gravity, I change it to 1.0. To make it easier to loop video in this project, you can follow these methods. Halfway through the video, add a marker. Because I made this project 3 minutes long, I will add a marker at 1 minute 30 seconds. so that it looks proportional. I will increase the emitter size X value so that the lines reach a wider range. Go back one frame from the marker section and then activate the keyframe from particles per sec. Go forward one frame again into the frame marked. Then change the value to zero. This setting is only to make the lines fade out. Next step, duplicate the particular layer. Drag the particular layer right to the marker area. If you do this method, then when the lines fade out, the lines will be reproduced from the next particular layer. We can loop this video according to the duration we want. The next step, we just need to add neon effect. Create a new solid layer. And after that, add glow effect. On the glow threshold, I change it to 45%. Glow radius 25%. Copy the glow effect. In glow effect 2, I change the glow radius to 100%. And for glow intensity, I changed it to 0.8. Now we just need to render the project. In the results of this video, I only changed the color on the background. That's how to create a simple looping neon lines video in After Effects. Thank you so much for watching. See you in another tutorial.